If you're coming to Canada and you're wondering what skills or handwork you can learn to use to make money on the side, then this video is for you. I'm going to tell you the skills that you should try and learn. Number one, how to cut hair. If you're a guy, please learn how to cut men's hair because there are lots of people here who don't have a way of cutting their hair and if your price is cheaper than others, they will patronize you. Number two is how to braid hair. We here in Canada we want to braid our hair, but trust me, to braid hair, it's like 100 to 120 dollars, which is good money. You can braid like 10 people in a week. That's 1,200. Another skill is cooking and baking. Lots of people have practice. People are always asking, who can bake a cake? Who can make meat pie? Who can cook first? People are so busy that if you can cook and bake well, you have the ready market waiting for you. Another skill is fixing of nails. Yeah, to fix nails or even to paint nails is between $25 to $80 depending. So if you can fix nails, pedicure and manicure, and you can do home service, that's money raining on you. Another one is photography because people are always doing like events, students, but they, if you're a professional photographer, I can take professional photographs. They're gonna love you and you're gonna have a ready market. Another one is making wigs. You know how we like our wigs, so if you can actually make weeks you're going to have a ready market on the side so if you can learn any of the skills another one that i almost forgot is sewing clothes or mending clothes so our men clothes here is quite expensive if your zip is spoiled in canada you have to throw the clothes with that because where are you going to mend it but if you can mend clothes or you can actually make clothes lace you can make a dress or you know the nigerian print people will patronize you here so these are skills and handbook that you can learn before coming to Canada. Please, if you can, hurry up and learn those skills, okay? Make sure you like and share this video, and I'm going to talk to you in the next video.